Bears win, Bears win, Bears win. In a game that felt oh so familiar, the Bears won with defense and special teams today. Getting a victory while Caleb Williams threw for less than 100 yards on the day. What an emotional roller coaster. Down 17-3 to at halftime, the Bears would score 21 unanswered points in the second half en route to a 24-17 victory. What a way to open the season. Caleb Williams became the first Bears rookie quarterback to win a season opener since 1950. He also became just the fourth number one pick in NFL history to win his NFL debut, breaking the 0 for 15 streak of the last 15 number one picks. He did all that without scoring a touchdown on offense and having less than 100 yards passing. We have to thank Ryan Poles for putting him in the position to do that. Caleb said they didn't make plays today, and that was enough to motivate him to be better next week. All that matters today is that we got the win. That is the thing we've been deprived of most as a fan base. Wins. And man, it felt so good to get a victory today. I don't care how the stat line played out or anything like that. Bears win, and that's what matters most. The guy I was most disappointed with was Coleman Shelton. He looked more like Sam Mustafer than he did a viable starting center today, and I'm worried about him moving forward. It was Matt Eberflus in the defense that won this game. Two interceptions, three sacks, a forced fumble, eight tackles for loss, and two touchdowns. One on a pick six and one on a blocked punt by Daniel Hardy, returned by Jonathan Owens for a touchdown. Huge day for the defense and the special teams. Jervon Dexter had a big game, getting a sack in the first game of the season, but it was our newest addition to the defensive line that made the biggest impact. Daryl Taylor had the best pass rush win rate in the NFL today. He had eight tackles, two sacks, and a huge game-changing forced fumble, providing the pass rush that we've been lacking opposite of Montez Sweat. Daryl Taylor's game today gives me more confidence in this pass rush going forward. We've lacked another guy who can get after quarterbacks, especially in obvious passing situations. Today we were able to do that without Austin Booker making an impact. Jervon Dexter, Demarcus Walker, and Daryl Taylor all had big games, and our secondary stepped up in a major way. It was an exhilarating game, reminiscent of an emotional roller coaster. But one thing is clear, you cannot count this team out. And once Caleb Williams and the offense get going, this team is going to be dangerous. The results weren't there today, but Caleb protected the ball and did enough to win the game zero turnovers, and things are going to get better from here. Things really feel different this time. Instead of watching the game like we used to with that pit in our stomach thinking, man, when are we going to blow this? I watched this entire game with confidence that we'd come back and win, and we did. And that is without the offense even getting going. There is so much to be hopeful for and so many reasons to be optimistic. But tonight, we're just enjoying the Bears' win. 1-0 to start out 2024. A lot of things to clean up, but what a way to start the season. Let me know how you guys are feeling. Bears win, Packers lose, and we are celebrating a new era of Bears football. Hit that like button for me. Stay tuned, and until next time, Bear Down!